Hello children. Today we are learning about the sound g. g. So we're learning to recognize our sounds. We're learning to say the sound. We're learning to read the letter and we're learning to write the letter. Here's our sound. Here's our letter that makes the sound g. g. Put your fingers on your throat and feel how that sound feels. G, g. Can you feel your throat moving with your fingers? G, g. My turn, your turn. G, g, g. G, g, g. G, g. G. Good. Here's our jolly phonics song and the action, we need to spiral our hands as if, as if our hand is water gurgling down a drain and say g g g g g g g g g g g The water gurgles down the drain the water gurgles down the drain. The water gurgles down the drain with a gu 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 gu. Here are some things beginning with g, with the letter G that makes the sound g g. On the left here, we have a girl. Girl. Did you know that one? Girl. What's this on the bottom? Grass. Grass. Here in the middle. Gold. Gold bars. Gold. I've never seen any of those gold bars. What do you think this one is? Are you saying fish? Fish starts with a f. It's not a gish. It's not a g gish. It's a goldfish. Gold fish. And at the bottom here, are you shouting sheep? Sheep starts with the sh sound. It's not sheep. It's a goat, goat. So here's the picture that goes along with our g sound. So when we are going to be writing and we do our ready and, we get up to here and then we need to go round her face all the way round and back up again and then down her hair and it says give her a curl. Well she's got a little curl in her hair so we go all the way round like a monkey tail. So we'd go ready and all the way round her face and back up again down her hair and do our loop. So that's what the basic shape looks like. Let's see if you can spot it. Here's the g, g. Let's say the sounds as they come out again. G, a, d. I, g, g, g. Did you at least get all the g, g sounds in there? Perhaps you got every sound. Okay, Piggy's back today. 
He just went on a little holiday out in the garden yesterday. Okay. Come on, Piggy, let's see what words you can read today. Ooh, I'm very good at reading, so I'll probably be able to do it. Hmm. I think you can too, Piggy. Okay. What's that first one, Piggy? Can you see the first sound? The first letter is G. Well done, Piggy. We've been learning that. G, A, P. G, A, P. Do you know what it is at home? That's right. What do you think, Piggy? Gap, gap. Yes, well done. G, A, P, gap. Well done, Piggy. Okay, let's look at the next one. G, E, T. G, E, T. Get. Well done, Piggy. Did you have time to get it at home? Yes, you need to wait so that everybody gets a chance to say it at home, Piggy. Did you get, get that answer at home? Okay, let's go for the next one. G, O, T. G, O, T. Do you know what it is at home? Did you get it? It's G, O, T. G, O, T. That middle sound has changed to O. Oh. It's not get. It's not got the A eh sound. It's got the O. Oh. Get. Got. It's got got. Did you get it, Piggy? Did you know it? Yep, I knew it. I knew it, Mrs. Wilson. Okay, and let's try the last one then. Hmm, it has the same letters as the other two words. It's got a g at the beginning and a t at the end, but this time the middle sound is ah. Hmm, ah. So it's not get. Got g a t g a t. Hmm, I think I know what it is. Do you know what it is at home? Do you know, children? Did you say gut g a t gut? If so, you're right. The word is gut. Did you know it, Piggy? Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Well done, Piggy. You're doing very well these days. Gut, I like your tummy is your gut. Well done. Okay, let's try writing this letter now. So hopefully you've got your pen and paper or your pencil. Okay, so, and this one's a little bit like the P we did yesterday. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll have to show you why. Let me do the first one. Ready and now we have to go all the way over. Oh, oh dear. All the way over. Then we have to go around the girl's face. And then down her hair. Down her hair. Give her a curl and then we have to actually loop back so we're ready to do our next letter. Okay, now you might be, why did I say it's a little bit like a per? The reason I said that is because when we did our ready and, our letter, just the first half of our letter comes back down to that level that the ready and is on. And then we have to go down, down, down. Okay, let's try again. Ready and we go all the way up like we do with, with lots of other letters like A. Ah. And then we've got to go around the girl's imaginary face, back up. We're going down her hair, down, down, down. Give her a curl. And then we curl back up so that we're ready to join our next letter on. Okay, one more. 
Ready and round the girl's face. Got a long face this time, doesn't it? And then back down her hair, down, down. And do a curl. They might not look exactly like this, but all you have to do is just try your best. Try your best and they will get better with practice. Okay, well done everybody. See you tomorrow.